Changes are coming for customers at restaurants and bars statewide. The governor said they'll be required to wear a mask during all interactions with wait staff or any other employees. This includes both indoor and outdoor seating. WCIA3's Jennifer Jensen joins us now. So, Jennifer, why is this being done and why now? Paul Governor Pritzker said it's because there has been an uptake in coronavirus cases. He says they're implementing the new rule to prevent further increase of the spread of the virus statewide and to allow restaurants and bars to stay open during the pandemic instead of shutting them down completely. During the COVID-19 pandemic, there are people who have complied with the state regulations and those who have not. If people would exercise good judgment and understand that they're just trying to be uh, courteous, kind, and protect the uh, frontline workers, we wouldn't have to have rules and everything that goes associated with it. Wear a mask. The increase in cases caused Governor Pritzker to require customers of restaurants and bars to wear masks anytime they come in contact with employees. That includes while you're ordering, being delivered food and drinks, and any other time staff serves you. Before, people only had to wear them while entering, exiting, and moving around the area. Sean Baird, owner of Watson Shack and Rail in Champaign, says he's noticed customers have been fairly compliant in the past. People are very receptive to the new rules and everything like that. There's only a few people that don't get it for some reason. Baird is used to the rapidly changing environment of the restaurant business, so he's taking this new rule in stride. Restaurant business is always like this. There's always um, something new getting thrown into the loop, and uh, you're always working on your feet and uh, adapting and changing. So this has clearly been the biggest year for that. Jim Roberts with the Champaign-Urbana Public Health District says the latest mask requirement should be taken seriously by customers and restaurant workers. Businesses are required to have people um, obey what the governor says, and we have that through our ordinance. And so if if a business owner has people that are not complying with this, they can ask them to leave. CUPHD is encouraging people to follow the guidelines not only for your own safety, but also in consideration for the health safety of people around you. Think of others other than yourself. Think of those frontline workers that are trying to serve you and take care of whatever your needs are. And by helping keep them safe, we keep businesses open, which keeps us all going on the right track. The new guidelines go into effect tomorrow. In the newsroom, I'm Jennifer Jensen, WCIA 3, your local news leader. Jennifer, thanks.